All right, guys, how's it going? Adam from Basic Labyrinth Cards, and here I'm again with another card opening. Today we are doing some more Team Coach. 12 packs. We've got 12 packs on here. We have had pretty extraordinarily good luck this year, so I've been pretty happy. We still haven't gotten um, a trophy wild card, so even a silver one of those would be pretty cool for the collection. We have gotten um, Tribute and on gold. A rookie wild card gold and we have gotten a gold card craft which was pretty good so if you haven't already go back and have a look see it's pretty easy to tell by the titles which one is <laughs> which but uh if you haven't already chuck us a cheeky like and subscribe maybe wait till the end of the video to see if you like this but i hope you do and um i'm just i don't want these on i keep swapping around um i hope you enjoy it so let's get straight into it we'll smash through these go pretty quick most of you have already probably seen these been out for a while now oh nice with a cheeky little silver parish to start with and then we got Mitch Owens, and then we have a mara the marvel which is a jamara ulu hagen and then we have one of these Scanlon's Tributes, I think they're meant to be in yeah, 1966 this year. This one has a gross uh, print line down there. Always check through the cards, fellas. You never know. They do, they do drop. I don't know if screws are technically a bad word. I'm sure someone will tell me in the comments. But they do muck up sometimes and uh, put a, an extra card at the end. Rare, very, very, very rare, but I've seen it happen. I do like the colours that they do this time on the silver card cross. Harry McKay, again, the same print line down the middle there. Some people say um, that I'm overpricing the Scanlon's cards, but it's just I get all my prices for these cards off of eBay. There's no formal site, so I do a average of the last... Oh, nice, we've got a team star power this time. It is Adam Sud. That's nice, I do love the team star powers this time. They take the team colours. A bit boring for Carlton, but I love the way it matches. The, the shirt, they look very nice. Max King. Um, no print line on that one. As I was saying, the um, they uh, I take the f average of the last... Uh, for if there is up to four um, sales and then I use that as the price which is why yes they are worth that much Ooh, thought this was going to be something good but it is something good to me I do love these cards Wellston gold um, so yeah that's just why they're worth that much because people are paying that much so, you can get, what, at least a dollar for one of the Scanlons. So, in some cases, okay. I haven't been getting many of these, the um, Best of Ferris. Which is good, because it's not like there's a load of them. Tell me if anyone's ever gotten a retro one. I don't know how scarce they are, but... I've never pulled one since, well, I think I've only been in the last two years, haven't I? Okay, so we've gotten one box hit so far. Dako, such a charming little lad. Errol, and we got just an old star power, so Max Born. So, Sarge, you're getting covered. On to Pelly. I know that, I don't know why they had to put the things there, the pop out. I know that the 1966 version had the same thing, because I've seen it while I've been looking up prices. Okay, okay, we got a um, Best and Ferris this time. It is a gold Best and Ferris, so that does make a big difference. I didn't realise last time, uh, while opening, I noticed in editing, that the Gold Coast Suns one was gold. I, th I thought that it was just the card. Owen Marshall. 
I thought it was the car, but it turns out that I had pulled it. I think it's a one in two box chance, if I remember correctly. Uh, sorry, silver, gold, yeah, one in 40 packs. So, it's more like a little over a box. Six cards over a box. I mean, Wayne's, another best of fairs. We got quite a few. Dacos, big Dacos there. Simpkin. I think I just popped that one. <laughs> Man, it, just even having an extra two packs during my normal opening makes it feel a lot bigger. Just, we're doing the 12 instead of the 10. Uh, another. That's from Ferris this time. Uh, Tom Stewart. And we've got the Draper. Still rocking that. Do. Wonder how long. Just means that he's a clean player because usually they only shave their head off after they've been doing drugs <laughs> after the pre season. Uh, it's the old, oldest one. Oh, we got, got it. What do we got? Oh, rookie card. I don't think this is a gold one. Cam McKenzie, I think this is just your normal rookie card. Still very nice uh, to get a box hit from a third of a box essentially. Leave him up. So, so far we've gotten uh, pretty much all of the box hits. So, there's, there's that. <laughs> that's, a, that's pretty awesome. Uh, lucky Neil. He's sitting there. And a turtle on his arm. What, two sparrows? <laughs> Very random. Josh Dunkley. So I pick it. And there we go. We got Darcy Parrish right there. What, 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 what. Very nice. Jack Varney. So, what year you reckon will be next year's Scanlands? 88. I can't remember what the last one was. Shy Bolton. Nice school photo there. Smiling for the camera. Oh, Bradley Hill doing the same thing. Very nice. And then we got a card craft of Callum Mills. Nice. I do like them. Maury Laird. We've got to have nearly the full set of that. I can't remember how many there are. I think there's like 70 or something. And that is it. So, but this one, we did manage to get the major box hit of, I'm pretty sure, the wild card and the team star powers are your guaranteed box hits. Pretty sure that's how it's always going to, well, not always, but going to be for a while. But these are our major hits pretty good I'd say I'm pretty happy with it um the rookie cards are pretty hard to get I know they say that they're not but this year's your year I only managed to get them I think they were out last year I never managed to pull one but this year I managed to get two so but all in all that's it if you enjoyed the opening, please leave a like. If you'd like to see more openings like this, please click subscribe. If there's any particular cards that you'd like to see me open, or you'd like to just brag about the cards you've pulled, leave it in the comments section. I do check it out all the time, because these are generally pretty nice, and uh, yeah, I don't get too many comments, so it's easy to um, comment back. But, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you again next time. Bye.